for luggage. Oh, okay, I don't want to know if that uh, car door is actually open. And also, uh, hard to see with the shadows, but there is another ladder over here. down this one on get close enough to it and the uh, trench coat was clipping through the stranger's torso there for a while hooray and for a while we can go through the doors isn't this excitement at its best hmm. Enough. Uh, with the train running out of control, I would think the logical thing would be to oh, separate the engine from the rest of the train or use the emergency brakes, but no, you can't do any of that. And for a change, it didn't glitch into anything. Don't know why we would be going down here, but let's do that anyway. And here we see two werewolves in their, in their unnatural environment, enjoying a nice bit of snack. And now their natural predator comes along. Oh, they put up a bit of a fight, but in the end it's futile. Thus the predator emerges victorious. So yeah, nothing in that uh, mid car as far as I'm aware. But hey, we have an axe there. Another axe, and this time it, I guess it's a slightly more high tech one than the one we had in the previous chapter. Look. It's got a this might come in handy. It's got red paint on it and everything. Hooray. You know that, no, I think of it that's some um, nice bit of detail there. I mean the game design developers didn't really need to make separate the models for each axe. They could have, could have just recycled it. Destroyed. There's no way to stop the train. Excuse me, emergency brakes? No? Then what are all those valves or turnable wheels at the ends of all each car? Now we want to reach that corpse you can see on the left side. And for that, we jump. indeed. But what does the key open? Oh well, I'm a lock I suppose. And jump back. And head back towards the way we begin. Progress. Excuse me, can I use the ladder? No, I'll just drop down then. For some reason... Oh, um, let's... Come to not the NH in fisticuffs with werewolves. Or accidentally jump down the side of the train. Wait. Oh, hello. Mm, you look like you might be a 
best and save everything. Um, okay, let's see if we can do anything about that guy being down there. Hello, can I glitch you off the side of the train? No, I'm used up now. Ah, can't quite aim down far enough. See you aim at something else. Look at there. Hooray! Hmm. We seem to be in a bit of a dilemma here. Oh, maybe not. Ah, come on. Yes. Could be more keen on jumping down this side. No. Mm hmm. This really is quite a bit of bad. bad. Oh, what the hell? Why don't we just shoot you to death? one way to do it. And down the ladder we go. Took a bit of time but much more much healthier than climbing down myself. Now well, shall we be attacked by something up here? Sounds that way. Bye bye, doggy. Now <coughs> let's see if we, our new farm tool can be put to use here. Yes, indeed. Hiram Pack. I will avenge your death, Hiram. Medical kit and silver bullets. Just a thing. So I have to wonder why Hiram would pack specifically silver bullets, since he wasn't really expecting werewolves. And if he, if he was supposed to be prepared for anything, why didn't he pack Mercury and Aqua Vampira as well? Ah, questions which shall ever go unanswered. Now I suppose we'll head in it this way. Oh, I didn't notice you there, lady. And down she goes. Dum -dum -di -dum. Oh. So useful key and hmm that guy up there doesn't look all that welcome so let's stick to the lower ground. And yeah, I won't don't suppose you'll be turning into a werewolf now. Actually I suppose you are already a werewolf, but you'll just be turning into a um, semi wolf walk form or something. I don't know what the proper term is to use with these. If there are any werewolf right uh, rights activists out there. Feel free to remain quiet. Oh, hello. Gave me a bit of a surprise there, you did. Okay, mm more wolfy people type here. Huh. Damn. This door's barred from the other side. It'll take more than a key to open this one. 
Hmm, so, um... Hmm, uh, I guess we'll try heading back over to the rooftops now. Well, might I rather go back as far as I can since on the rear end of the cars we have werewolves. And it doesn't sound all that smart to be wiping up right in their faces, so... Oh. Um, actually, no ladders on this side, so we'll have to make, <coughs> like, something and jump. Say, um, make it like Cuba, perhaps. And jump, and get the silver bullets out. You, you and all your kind will die. You shall my tribe to the four winds. You thought that you had killed us all, but we have survived. You will not survive. We'll see about that. Uh. That was the alpha of the Hawkendire tribe. I had a feeling we didn't wipe them out completely back in 24. So why didn't you shoot him? Oh, silly werewolves. You shouldn't go jumping off the edges of rain cars like that's what my mama you always said. That, and you shouldn't accept bullets from strange men, especially if they are coming at you very fast from the, the muzzle of a gun. Mm. Nah. Mm. Okay. Save in case. Yeah, I can't make that jump. So. Let's try again from here, hopefully without the recording crapping out. Oh, so we can jump onto the last car from here. Uh, I'm not really sure why you'd even design a car that's uh, higher in the front like that. Wouldn't that create uh, all sorts of air resistance problems? Oh well. So, to get through the blast door, we whack it with the axe. And the sparks, they fly. Uh, up, up and away. Since, obviously, we can't just jump off the train or anything. I mean, even the werewolves can jump the I feel less insulted knowing that it was you who destroyed my tribe. When I have built a new tribe, we will honor your deaths on this day. I could just be a bit less of a silly accent. Oh yeah. Oh, hey, what? Ah, hello. Okay, for some reason I have trouble activating the health kit. Yeah. Ah, okay, and so I uh, automatic use that's helpful. Run for Is it suddenly not lethal to jump off? Beats me.